Hello, my name is Manfred and welcome to my kitchen. Today, we're going to learn one of the basics in the kitchen. Today, we're going to do the toasting cashews. Now, the cashews are very, very delicious nut. Uh, so all we need is the cashews, the stovetop, the large frying pan, and hey, this is very exciting and quick. The first thing we always do in the kitchen is wash the hands because when you're out there in the public and they be touching stuff and you be, oh, I don't know. Anyway, get the hands clean because you don't want to contaminate anything in the uh, kitchen. And also make sure that you clean the fingernails because you're always using the fingernails in the kitchen. Okay, this is very quick. There are many recipes that call for the uh, cashews to be toasted. One you can get here on, uh, on uh, manfreedinthekitchen.com is the Thai cashew salad. Very delicious. Now, this is how quick it is. Set the heat to medium. Get the large frying pan with the, with the good thick base, on the, the thick base on the bottom and just take and <laughs> sprinkle some in. Now notice that there is no oil in here. There is just the, the nut and the heat. Now the cashew is the fruit and the name of it comes because the way it grows, they call it the inverted heart. Yeah, that's what they say. It comes on the small tree, it's growing uh, on the evergreen, and uh, you can, uh, oh, by the way, the cashew on the tree comes on what's called the apple, the cashew apple. And the, on the end of the apple is the nut. So this tree can give you two things. The apple does not transport very good, so uh, they make the drinks out of them, you know, and uh, put them in the fancy drinks when you go to the tropics because that's where the uh, tree grows. And uh, the other thing that you get is that right on the end is the nut, but this is nut is really the seed of the plant and it grows on the end of the apple, yes. It's uh, roasted to take away the raw toxins. Oh, look at that, can you see them turning Oh, you can smell them. You can smell the aroma of the, of the uh, cashews uh, uh, being roasted. Oh, yes, and you can see they're just coming a little bit of the brown. Now, the reason that you do the roasting of any of the nuts is to bring out the flavor uh, in this. So that's what we're doing. We're going to use this on, on, uh, on a, the Thai salad, the Thai chicken salad, and oh, the one thing, because these are almost done, Manfred's going to show you here in the minute. You can see that they're just a little brown. They're almost done. That is how quick it is over the, over the heat. If you heat, oh, too much. There they are. They've got the little specks on them right there. That's enough. If you, if you heat them too much, we set this off, they get bitter. You don't want to make them bitter. That's it. There you are. Can you see the, the roasting uh, tech guy? Can you get that close up? Can you see how it's roasted right there and they're all, that's all there is to it. There's the perfect roasted nut. You kids, beginning cooks and new cooks can do this to bring out the flavor. It will impress the family, the relatives and the friends and that's all there is to it. Another basic in the kitchen from manfreedinthekitchen.com. I am no chef, but I can cook.